Hi, I'm Blake from Technobuzz.com, and in today's Technobuzz video, I'm going to be unboxing the Microsoft Wedge Touch Mouse Surface Edition. Alright, so let's begin by taking a quick look around the box here. We have on the front a uh, Surface Wedge Touch Mouse. Um, now the only difference between this version and the normal wedge touch mouse is the color of the metal on the sides as far as I know, but we'll take a look at the mouse in just a second. Um, there really isn't too much else uh, around on the boxes. Uh, it is Bluetooth, Windows uh, compatible obviously with BlueTrack technology, but I'm sure we'll get more of that on the back. Nothing else too, too interesting here. Let's see what it says back here. We got four-way touch scrolling. It's designed for the Surface uh, Windows RT, Windows 8, and Windows 8 Pro. Um, works on virtually any Surface with Blue Track. And let's see what it says here for system requirements. Um, requires a Surface with Windows RT, Windows 8, or Windows 8 Pro. Uh, kind of strange that they said Surface with Windows 8 and not just and not only with Windows 8 Pro. That's that's definitely an interesting point there. Um, 150, 150 megabytes of space and a AA battery that is included in the box. Uh, not too too exciting a box. Let's just dive into the actual product here. I got Big Red to help me with the unboxing. I'm just going to slice open the sticker there and let's take a look at what's inside the box. I believe this is a flip up box of sorts. So let's take a look at the mouse there we have it there is the wedge touch mouse surface edition and like I said it has that same sort of um, graphite black I guess it would be that comes on the actual Microsoft Surface device I'll take a look at that in just a second um, there's your AA battery and some manuals and other information in there. Not nothing too too important or crazy. So let me just close this back up, push it off to the side. Let's take a look at the mouse here. Now I know in the promos and everything that you know they talk about how tiny this thing is, and this really is tiny. Let's see if I can get some size examples here for you. Uh, this is an old iPod Nano. Um, and you can see from a width standpoint, it really isn't a whole lot longer than the iPod Nano would have been. Um, and yeah, so that's, it's very, very small. Um, doesn't feel like it weighs a whole lot, but let me put in the battery here, see if I can get you some weight. Um, has a spring-loaded kind of release to the battery compartment, which is kind of cool. And the battery goes in this way. And there we have it. And there's the blue track light there. Uh, even with the battery, it's incredibly light. And um, you know, it really, and because of its size, I mean, you could toss this thing in in your bag and have no problem at all. Wouldn't take up any extra room. Even you can even put this in a pocket. It's that small. Um, and like I said about the uh, metal on the actual mouse, there it is designed to match the actual surface itself. Let's see if I can get that into focus at all. Focus, no, there we go. You can see that it matches the same type of metal used on the Microsoft Surface um, there. So yeah, this is the uh, Wedge Touch Mouse Surface Edition. And uh, yeah, it's, I just felt like giving it an unboxing because a lot of people are curious as to what this guy actually is like, what it actually feels like. And uh, from a standpoint here, I, I, I can see myself being able to use it. It's a little bit weird and I can have to get used to there being no support for my uh, hand. But other than that, I could see this being a very, very uh, nice accessory for your Microsoft Surface or any other computer when you have the standard Bluetooth edition. Anyways, guys, this has been Blake from Technobuzz.com. Make sure to check out our other Technobuzz videos and like, rate, subscribe, and comment. And visit us on our website at techno-buzz.com. Thanks for checking out this Technobuzz video, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Have you visited our website at technobuzz.com? If you haven't, it's a great place to get all the latest in technology and gaming. Make sure to keep up to date on all things Technobuzz by following us on Twitter at Mr. Technobuzz. And if you have an idea for a future show, let our creators know by visiting us in the forums at forum.technobuzz.com. Thanks for watching.